Here's how you can edit your slow motion video to pick the exact moment you want in slow-mo. And hey, if you find this tip useful, there are plenty more iPhone and iPad quick tips on my channel. Make sure you press that subscribe button down below so you don't miss any. I'll start off in the camera app where I'm going to scroll through and get to slow-mo video. I'm then going to record the moment I want to capture, in this case a pebble falling into a lock pool, and you'll notice that it films it just like a normal video. From here, tap onto the thumbnail and I will open the video up in the Photos app where I can now make some adjustments. I'm going to press Edit in the top right corner and that will bring me into the video editing mode. From here at the bottom, there are two horizontal bars that I can use to change my slow motion video. The top one you'll have seen before on other videos and that's the one where you can pull in from the left or right hand side to shorten the clip from the beginning or the end to trim away the edges. I'll do that to get rid of some of the empty recording at the beginning before anything exciting happens. The bottom horizontal bar will let me choose exactly which portion of my video is in slow motion. Because the camera's recorded the whole video in 240 frames per second, I can actually customise and have the whole video, or just a particular chunk of it, in slow motion. The white bars that are closest together represent normal speed, and the ones which are more spaced out represent slow motion. By adjusting the edges of this bar, you can then customise the exact moment that appears in slow motion. So for me, the moment that pebble hits the water, right through to the end of the ripple will be in slow motion, the rest of the video will be in normal speed. When you're finished, you press done in the top corner, and you can choose to save it on top of the old clip and replace it, or save it as a new clip. I'll choose the latter. From here, back in your Photos app, and you can play your new slow motion video that you've now customised and edited. It's a really simple tip, but I'm always surprised how many people don't realise they can change the part of the video that's slow motion. And this opens up some really fun and creative possibilities, just like this lovely video of my cat, Mr Tibbs, flying across the garden in slow motion. I had to fit that in there somewhere, because who doesn't want to see Mr Tibbs? Mm -hmm.